Welcome back, everybody. I am the Jimmer. This is the Super Sloopers Tournament. Going through all of the introduction videos. Up next, we've got the Aqua Dis... Aqua Dis... Oh, I was going to say that wrong. Aqua Disayak? Aqua Disic. Yes, that's what I'm going with. I know it's not right, but that's the best you're going to get. Uh, that's by Synth2. You can see coming in just under budget. Let's get it loaded in and take a look. Very red. Very, very, very red. But a nice looking design. Another uh, Trimoran. I suppose with the uh, the rules being what they are, the, uh, the Trimoran makes sense. Um, with some large sails keep you from rolling over. Has uh, propellers as well. It's so, like, yeah, it's got some ammo out here on the uh, outriggers. A decent broadside, large sails, got some good um, armoring on the sail blocks. Hopefully, keep those alive a little bit longer. Let's see if there's any surprises in here. Looks like some stone for armor. Very thin. All right, this is the Aquades, Aqua, Aqua de Siec, Aqua de Sic, Siec. <laughs> this this video is just gonna be me trying to pronounce the name. This is the Aqua de Sic by Synth Two. Oh, another unfortunate flag not loading. All right, let's uh, get into a battle. Oh, you can see it's in... Uh, okay, I got it now. It's in the uh, the faction colors. forgot I set it up. So, uh, yeah, on uh, Team 1, it'll be the red. And on Team 2, it'll be the yellow from the... Uh, oh, uh, the, uh, what was the name of the tournament? The Teams Tournament. I can't remember what I called it now. But uh, where everybody was kind of mixed up and on Teams... It was a lot of fun. If you didn't, if you didn't watch it, uh, go back and uh, watch watch the whole playlist. The the, the battles are, are really good, really fun to watch. Team Deathmatch. That's what it's called. I've got them all. Uh, you can see them all in the uh, the Team Deathmatch uh, playlist if you haven't watched them already. Yeah, it looks like really, really sturdy design. I mean, it's taken a, it's taken a lot of shots, and uh, both clones look just fine. Oh, losing a big chunk of the sail there, though. That's going to hurt the speed. But I guess with, with the screws, it really doesn't uh, depend on the sail all that much. More of just a, uh, a bonus to the top speed as, as an absolute requirement. Oh, losing the whole back of the ship there. Surprisingly, still keeping the screws, but yeah, that drops it down below 85%. Let's take a look at the uh, the yellow one. Oh yeah, it looks like it's lost pretty much all of its screws, but it has all of its sails, so yeah, go, go, go redundancy. Oh no, I guess not all the sails. That's most of the sails. Oh man, of course, as I say that, there goes the sails. This one's gonna be dead in the water. Looks like he's going to make it both uh, clones right about 85%. 45 seconds to go. Yeah, it looks like the yellow one is going to get taken out here. It is down around 83%. So, and there we go. Down below 80%. So fantastic. Getting the 80% uh, with plenty of time to spare. So congratulations, Synth2, Aquadasic, 
making it in past the uh, the tech expansion, and uh, I look forward to seeing how this one does. We haven't seen too many uh, really tanky entries, and this one definitely looks like it uh, fits the tank role. But that's it for this episode. I hope you guys enjoyed. Um, we'll see you again in the next episode.